Illum Tools, our lighting analysis add-in for Autodesk Revit, breaks new ground and improves some challenging workflows with the introduction of the Projected Calculation Points command series. What is a projected calculation point? Imagine a horizontal plane of points at some distance above an irregular surface, or a series of surfaces. Project a vector downward from each point until it intersects a surface. Place a calculation point there. You can optionally enable multiple intersections, which means the vector continues until striking additional surfaces that may be below the first. Constraints can be placed on the projection distance if necessary. Now visualize that the projection does not have to be horizontal. You can project from a vertical plane as well. The new projected points capability makes it easy to cover a number of surfaces in one operation. You can find the projected points commands in the Illum Tools Add Points menu. There are three options projected, topography, and stairs. They are all similar, and topography and stairs are actually just shortcuts to doing the same thing with the projected version. Let's see how they work. The projected points command provides three options for selecting the projection area. You can use an existing region as the projection area, draw a region on the fly, or select an element as the point target. Let's try it. Using the Select Elements option allows Revit objects to be selected as projection targets. Or let's go to a section view and we can draw a region on the fly. Now we've put points on the front of this irregular building face. Let's try using an existing region to handle the multiple slope surfaces stacked on top of one another like a parking garage. Let's open the dialog under the projection options and select multiple intersections enabled. Now we've actually hit all the floors in one operation. That's fantastic. In a similar way we can also use a projection for facades of varying depths. As we quickly sketch that region. all the surfaces including the curve. We can even project points to topography. This makes Illum Tools the first illuminating engineering software to easily be able to place points on exterior surfaces at irregular elevations. You also have complete control over the light meter as well. Normal to the surface, horizontal, or aimed at some point. Opening the Projection Options section of the dialog, we can also exclude items as a target. We can do this by category, or we can actually select those items. Excluding the mass cylinders eliminated them as projection targets, but what we really need to do is eliminate the points beneath them as well. Let's click on the Mass tab and let's select the cylinders again. Now the points are gone. The new stairs option for projected points makes dropping points on stairs like entire stairwells a one-step operation. Fantastic! That solves a big problematic workflow for a lot of current users. Projected points commands are available in the latest releases of Illum Tools 2020, 2019, and 2018. Get out there and use it and let us know what you think.